Um, what had happened is I had left work, I was headed down the street to, uh, the parts store, and somebody in a minivan pulled out in front of me, and I hit the side of them at about 35. Uh, it totaled the FZ6, um, bent the forks, um, Bent the subframe, tore up the hand controls, and bent my tag, the key that went between the handlebars and the ignition got bent, or in between the handlebars and the ignition, yeah, that makes sense. But the key was between the handlebars and the headlight. That got bent somehow, broke a mirror, um, broke uh, one of the bark busters or both of them snapped one completely off and the other one was just kind of dangling uh, ripped the headlight loose caused the alarm to spaz out um, I shut the video off, or the camera off right after because I didn't want to lose any of the evidence because in motorcycle I can say generally look at the motorcycle as as to you know fall um, but you know I wanted proof that it was not my fault and this and that and, you know so I shut the camera off um, I ended up with a chip bone in my leg I guess there's, the doctor said there was some kind of, there's bladders in your knees of some kind. And I ruptured both of those. I uh, had some road rash on my left knee and fractured my left thumb. in a leg immobilizer for about a week and then after that the doctor discovered a, the fracture of my thumb and put me in like a, a splint for that and I had to wear that for like nine weeks But overall, I mean, after the settlement and everything, that's what I've been waiting for. Is this happened May 10th of this year. It was, and it was a Thursday. I remember because it ruined my weekend plans. But, um... I had just got out of work, like I said, you know, we, I work uh, Monday through Thursday, so it was about uh, quarter to four. But yeah, I mean, the settlement, I'm not going to talk about financial, you know, what I walked away with, uh, but I'm a lot better off than I was. And normally, I'm not the type of person, you know, I've been in situations where I could have sued people before and that, but I, I just never could bring myself to do it. But this lady, I mean, all she, all she said to me, because I was up walking around a little bit after it happened, I was worried about my bike, and she said, uh, and it was just like this, I'm glad you're okay, and she walked off. 
What is that wrecker doing? This thing gets more stairs. Well, my other bike gets more stairs than the FC6, and this gets more stairs than both of them. And until I get the deal from sick ass racing, this is how I. Secure it because I've got a keyed ignition in that coming for it. But I'm going in Walmart. If you like that video and you haven't done it already hit that subscribe button hit the bell icon for notifications hit that little thumbs up button share it with your friends and comment I'll respond to each comment individually as soon as I can usually within the same day and I don't know how true it is, but I heard if you click that bell icon, you start hearing bells chiming, like the old school church kind of bells. And if you hit that subscribe button, maybe it's something that you have to do both at the same time, I don't know you hit that subscribe button and ACDC's Hell's Bells start playing. Again, I don't know if it'll work, but what does it hurt to try?